Hello everybody, thank you for stopping by. They call me Kane. It's a pleasure to be with you here today. We're going to be doing some kindergarten today, if you haven't already noticed. But today we're going to be having a goal in mind, and today we're going to be talking to... Uh, who is it? We're going to be talking to Jerome. Jerome is going to be our buddy today. I kind of split up these episodes because just because this Let's Play can get out of hand very quickly, just due to the nature of the game. Did I not take enough money? I don't think I took enough money. Apologies for that. Due to the nature of the game, it can get very, very uh, out of hand and just not be enjoyable for the most part to watch. So what we will do is we will have goals set in mind for every episode. This one being the Jerome episode. So what we want to do today is we want to go straight to Monty. Hello, Monty. Monty is going to be selling us quite a bit of everything. We're going to get the yo-yo. We're going to buy... What are we going to buy? We're going to buy some cigarettes. Yeah, some cigarettes. And then a screwdriver. To afford the screwdriver, though, we're going to have to eat some apples. So before we do that, hang on a sec. We need a dollar. There we go. All right, Monty. Give me a... Uh, screwdriver thank you very much and now the morning shall end so what do we have going on today we got some big stuff going on today we do uh, that is it thank you very much there is the bell <clears throat> so we're doing something that we haven't done yet in this let's play except for what we're about to do now <laughs> which is uh yo my man you got a yo-yo here you go you can have it if you uh if you'll let me be if you'll be my buddy of course yes we know that we need to find the laser. That is what we're going to be doing today, is finding the laser. Awesome. It should be in a bucket, so this is what I need to pay attention to. Awesome. It should be in a box somewhere. Just grab it and go. Don't linger there too long. He checks back frequently. Okay, great. So we need to find this laser. I'm ready. Go to Shacker. All right, here we go. We're going to head straight to the janitor's locker. You know, obviously get this guy out of the way. Here's my pass, young man. Yep. So we, so now we got to look for the correct box. So there's the stolen stuff box, and then there's this regular box. Now, I feel like this has to be something, right? Box is up too high. I need to find a way to get it down before I can look inside. Is it this box? Or is it something else? Or is it the other box? Could be the other box. No? Let's see. Oh, wait. Yeah. Could be this box, right? Ultimate $5 bill. Take the note. No. We want to... We got to find this freaking... <laughs> There's a free... We got to find this freaking, like, laser pointer. I, you know, he, he said box. And this is a box. This, these both are boxes, but this box is up too high to reach. I need to find a way to get it down before I can look inside. How would I do that? How would I be able to do... Wait, what is that? It looks like this screw is loose. Oh my god. Oh, you love to see it. Holy crap. Okay. So now there's the stolen stuff. Okay, there's a bunch of junk in here along with Jerome's laser pointer. Yo, we got it. Let's get the hell out of here. All right, great. Hey man, you're the bell. Go back to your class. We will. Well, did you get it? What? Okay kids, we all heard that. That's the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. Here, we're having slop today. How exciting. We'll talk at lunch. Let's go to lunch. Hey kid, over here. Okay. Well, did you get it? Oh, baby, we got it. I got it, dude. That's awesome. I just hope the uh, I just hope the janitor doesn't notice. It can be pretty terror. Uh oh. Which one of you dead children went into my closet? We have to have a plan. We need to run or hide or hide the laser pointer. One of the two. One of the three, actually. Oh, jeez. Oh, there's a new hint. Oh, gee, sounds like he noticed. You better hurry up and hide that thing before he gets here. If he catches you with it, you're a dead man. Where do I hide it? Um, the garbage can. Quick, throw it in there. Yo, great idea. It's a garbage can. I'm not going to dig through it. No, no, no. I need to hide the laser. There we go. Well, anyone want to step forward? 
No? Wow, what a surprise. I lost my voices for the characters just because I can't remember what I did for everybody. What about you, little junior principal? I took your lasery thingy this morning. I'm sure you want it back. Search me, man. I don't have it, so screw off, or I'll tell you my dad, you peed in the water fountain again. What the hell? You win this round, kid. What about you? You've been in my closet. Turn out your pockets. How does he know we've been in his closet? Hmm, nothing. Still gotta keep my eye on you. Oh, just leave the poor things alone. You're always looking for a reason to impale a child on that mop of yours. <laughs> so what if I am? Ain't nothing wrong with impaling a child. You don't say that out loud. Just go, just go sell your mystery meat. Fine, but mark my words, someone will pay for going into my closet. Actually, before you get started, that garbage needs to be, s no, what needs to be empty? Go take care of it. No, that's where the laser is. Stupid lunch lady making me do my stupid job. Dude, our laser just left. <laughs> laser just left the building. Well, that was fast. There's no way you took it all the way to the dumpster. That's true. Would you relax, woman? I dropped it off in the bathroom. Okay, so it's in the bathroom. I'll get it after the bell rings. All right. Sheesh. Old Broad is just mad that the kids like my food better than hers. So the garbage is in the bathroom. Jesus Christ. Well, that didn't go as quite as planned. At least you're not dead. That's a relief. Uh, so what now? I hate to ask this of you, but you need to go get it. The janitor said that it's in the bathroom. Uh, what's in it for me? I know I'm asking a lot from you, but just work with me on this. I'll make it worth your while. Sounds good. I'll pay off the lunch lady so you can go get out. Just hurry back. The janitor will be taking the garbage out shortly after the bell rings. Okay, go pay her off then. Yes. Ah, okay. She said she let you out. Great. Go get it. Sounds good. All right, so this is where... Because we've been, we've been into the bathroom before. And the bathroom has the hall monitor who we already know does not take hall monitor passes. Instead, he takes cigarettes. That's why we have the cigarettes. Huh? You're not supposed to be in here. I gotta take you to the principal's office. That is, unless... Well, I'm out of cigarettes. If you had some, I'd be willing to let you off. I do! Hell yeah. Thanks so much, little guy. Go do what you gotta do. Cool, thanks. See you around, little man. See ya. He's a nice fella. <laughs> he's disgusting, but he's a nice fella. Okay, is this our bag here? Looks like I'm digging through this after all. Get the stupid laser pointer. There we go. Great job. Okay. Try to bring the laser pointer. Okay, wait a sec. Time, time the frick out here. Try to bring the laser pointer to Jerome again. Dot, dot, dot. And then I'm sure we had a hint. What was the hint? Is it this one? Hide the laser pointer in the garbage can. All right, we've done that. You need a screwdriver to, okay, we've done that. You need to have cigarettes, we've done that. If you go to the restroom without cigarettes, okay, we know about that. Uh, you need to buy cigarettes in the schoolyard, we've done that, and that was pretty much it, okay. All right, let's go. I think we're going to recess now, right? Oh wait, we need to get to the cafeteria, cafeteria. Oh, did the slob give you the runs? How about that? Yeah, we know, diarrhea, funny, funny, haha. -ha. Oh, what is a janitor doing out here? Hey kid. Come over here. Okay. Jerome befriend... Uh, uh, Jerome brief me on your little mission. Did you manage to get the laser from the bathroom? Uh, yes. Good. I don't know if you noticed, but the janitor is waiting. Jerome is... W oh, <laughs> sorry. The janitor is watching Jerome a little too closely. He looks like he's about to kill him. We gotta do something about it. What do you mean? That old man has been harassing kids for decades. Decades. I think it's time we finally got even with him. How do we do that? I'm going to take the laser as collateral for my services here today. He'll get it back when he pays me. Okay, now what? Jerome gave me this. It's one of his dad's little bugs. Little things tend to pop off or pop if they don't like what they hear. Don't worry, I deactivated it. What do I do with it? You just worry about putting it behind the janitor without him seeing you. I'll handle the rest. Come see me when it's done. Okay. <laughs> Should I place the device here? I guess. Oh, that's the thing that was in the cubby. Okay, cool. Tell Monty you placed it. Okay. Did you place it? Yep. Excellent. This is going to be good. Now, Jerome! Get back here. I ain't done questioning you yet. Oh my god. Holy crap. 
<laughs> Jesus, dude. I told you to distract him, not blow him up. Eh, he had it coming. <laughs> well, he certainly did, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> the janitor just exploded. Yes, he did. The irony here is that there's no one to clean up the parts. <laughs> I see. Can we just go inside? Yes, I think that would be for the best. I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for show and tell. Why don't you uh, go first? What did you bring? Uh, yes, I brought a screwdriver. Oh, a screwdriver? That's my favorite drink. Excuse me. Uh, tell the janitor. Uh, the janitor was mentioning how he wishes he had it sold his to Monty. Apparently, there's a loose shelf in his closet or something. Ah, that's where we probably would have got the idea. I see, I see. Okay, who's next? Nice. Well, children, that was a fun show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all had a fun day today. I'll see you tomorrow. I wonder what Tuesday's like. <laughs> Like, is it going up on a Tuesday? All right, here we, <clears throat> here we go, drone. Well, kid, I'm impressed. You put up with this whole crazy day just because I told you it'd be worth it. Better be. It is. Trust me. It's just a shame, and it required Monty taking the laser pointing pointer until I pay him back. Either way, you've earned this. Uh, what is it? It's a mold for a key to my dad's office. You get this made, and you can go in there anytime you want. You couldn't just give me a key? <laughs> How can I even get this made? Monty can hook you up. Just bring it to him at the beginning of the day and he'll figure it out for you. Oh, that easy. Sounds good. This is where we part ways, man. You're pretty cool. I'll see you on Tuesday. Goodbye. Day complete. There we go. When you unlock too cool for school. Items unlocked. It's a key mold. So we can use the key mold for the principal's office, I guess, whenever we want when we talk to Monty. Great job. We earned zero dollars, right? Yeah, we earned zero dollars today. We used up all of our money. And that is gonna do it for today's episode in... There is it, there is it. You gotta wait for the queue. Cana Garden, thank you guys for stopping by. If you guys enjoyed the video, if you did, please make sure to hit that like and subscribe and I will see you in the next Monday. Take care.